guys welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are doing absolutely good so again i have a quick and easy diy tutorial of this altered mixed media jewelry box so it is a very quick diy and very easy it can be made so watch the video till the end as we have amazing craft giveaway happening so let's get started so this is the box which i have and from inner side it doesn't look old but it is a very old box so on first thing which i am doing is i am applying a thick coat layer of white heavy gesso i let the gesso dry naturally if you are in a hurry you can also heat set it but i would really recommend you that you allow the gesso to dry naturally so it's dried and you can see some glitter so it is a fairy dust from expressions craft next i am taking up my eye mix texture paste and also i am using this stencil from expressions craft only it is a round mandala stencil so to apply the texture paste i am using my palette knife so i am just placing the stencil onto my box and onto some random areas i am applying the texture paste i am mix texture paste is very good it dries quickly also it has a very nice consistency and can easily be applied with stencil also so i'll just show how it looks so you can see how beautifully the texture has come out of the rounded mandala stencil so if you're looking out for texture paste i would recommend you to buy i mix texture paste with my IMX texture paste to make it a very nice texture. These deco stones are very versatile and can be used in various ways. Today I am mixing them with my texture paste and make a very nice texture onto my box. In my last video you might have seen the DIY mirror in that I have just colored them and used them. See a very nice texture has already been created by mixing the deco stones. So I am just applying the deco stone and texture paste mixture onto my box. Also now I am sprinkling the deco stones as you can see them later on how good they will be looking. After that using the steam stencil and texture paste I have covered half area of the base box to give it a very nice texture. I am using eye mix chalk paint pale sunset gold. The second color which I am using is this coral peony and the third color which I will use is this raspberry red. The chalk paints from Expressions Craft are very versatile and can be used in various ways. So if you are a regular viewer of my channel then you might have seen various tutorials which I have already created in the past. So to check them out you can also have a look on my playlist diy playlist which i have created where you will see all the diy and lovely tutorials which i have made make sure you're blending the colors very well to give it a very nice colorful effect for the top portion to give it a very nice effect so in the video i'll just share how i'm creating the base but you can check the pictures on how i decorated it as i wanted this video to be very short quick and i wanted to focus on how the base is created and how the colors are blended so in the video i have not showed how i decorated it but surely will come up with another tutorial on how i'm decorating my altered projects 
decorating i have added different size of deco stones i have also added some laces and sentiments and apart from that i have also added flower and feather so let's start with the giveaway so all you need to do is follow this instagram account crafters giveaway and some basic guidelines are mentioned so you just need to follow them and the results will be announced on this kanak jaipur's youtube channel only so if you have not subscribed to your channel then do subscribe and press the bell icon to receive the notification so thank you guys for watching this video don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to our channel also if you are recreating our diys then do tag us and use hashtag diykanak on instagram so happy crafting thank you for watching